Hi, Super Spruce here, back with another video. It's sort of a new, a new game. Um, it's actually really not all that new, but it's a game called Infinite Layers. And this game was, I recently did a poll on my Discord, and I had like about eight options for, um, for like what I would do next. And this received the majority. Actually, well, actually, technically, it it tied with another game but that game is currently i'm going through like technical difficulties so yeah that game is world restoration hopefully um that game will work but in the meantime there's this game so this game there's infinite layers um i i have done a little bit of this game and it doesn't look like there's any way to hard reset the game which i wish i could do but it, you can see it's it's Basically, an anti mirror dimensions ripoff, um, because if it says dimensions money, which I is actually what antimatter is referred to in like the code, and then infinity points. So, like if you just do this, like you can see dimension six produces dimension five. It's really the same thing. When you when you buy something, you can see it um, um, it doubles the multiplier. On it so you can just buy max all these um, it's actually can I click M um, no I can't click M Hopefully, there's automation in this game but it, it looks like this is like what this game is so I can gain 20 infinity points 21 infinity points so I'm not sure exactly they're probably just the prestige layer the standard prestige layer it's probably not that Crazy. I'm just going to gain 20 infinity points. So you have 20 infinity points and one infinity power. So it looks like this. You can see just how much of a sort of like a, a bit of a like it's like a ripoff. But th there is like some aspects unique to this game. Like this has way more layers. Like although maybe they're not as detailed. There's way more layers than in um, antimatter dim and antimatter mentions or any of its mods. So hopefully, it looks like, I hope it, it costs one infinity point. And, oh yeah, the infinity power, it looks like it, predictably, it multiplies all dimensions. That That's that's totally, that I think that's totally normal. It costs 100 to get infinity. It looks like these infinity points do nothing by themselves. So I'm just gonna get as many. Oh, okay. It looks like that's as many as I can get. So, um, can't, unfortunately, it doesn't look like you can click M. You can click this max all button. So, I can just spam this, and it's actually, it's a lot faster than I thought it was. This is actually, I, I'm guessing it resets when you, um, I'm guessing this thing resets. The infinity, um, your infinity power probably resets. That's my guess. And... Now I have um, some six dimensions, and hopefully I can gain. I need to gain um, 91 infinity points if I want to get like infinity dimension two, and that may be just too far off at this point. What I'm gonna do? I'm, I'm just gonna um, wait a little bit and just see if I can get there. So yeah, see you in a bit. Okay, so it's only been a few minutes and. Um, I'm up to E60 money, and look at this. I get over 100 infinity points. So, yeah, infinity power does reset. But now I can get the second infinity dimension, which will be really important um, if I want to get a lot of um, money and more infinity points quick. So, looks like I'm, I'm, it's going really fast already. Um, all I have to do is just click this max all... I'm gonna go for 65 infinity points so I can get the next um, thing of infinity dimension one. So here we go. Um, so now infinity. I'm gonna be getting twice as many inf as much infinity power, and this is gonna allow me to get. Um, this is gonna allow me to progress a lot quicker. So you can see how this is an antimatter dimensions ripoff, basically. And the thing is, if you, it's interesting, if you just wait, um, 
a little bit and then you just click max all you get like a huge burst in production like like this like it it's not it doesn't go slow um after you click max all and here is dimension seven i'm not sure if there if it goes to eight or if it goes higher um i'm, I'm not exactly sure but you can see um I, I can now gain hundreds of infinity points so it looks like i'm going to be going for the next iteration again of um of the infinity dimension one and then eventually maybe infinity dimension three and also i can change the theme there's default there's dark um there is this theme um which is pretty cool and um this theme you, you can vote um vote in the comments for your favorite theme and i will use that theme so i again like i i I, d I don't want it to just be around me. I, I I want my channel like I go visit the Discord because I'm I'm now I now conduct and conduct polls in the Discord every month or so, um, where it's a majority vote for um, which game do you want me to play the most. So, and the majority vote was this game. So that's why I am I am playing it. And also, you can vote for more than one thing. However, um, that means your votes for some of the things will not be as strong. So, yeah. I, I just wanted to point that out because... Um, because this... this because I, I really want um, my channel to be more centered around the viewers instead of just... Like, it's going to be incremental games, but... Like, I want you to have a say in what I do. So look at this. I am approaching... A Google money which it's pretty crazy like like it's pretty it's pretty crazy how I I didn't know the numbers and the numbers are increasing quite fast in this game so it looks like I'm just gonna wait until I can get 10,000 finny points so there it is so I can get infinity dimension 3 so this is gonna really keep my production boosted and now just to, to get 10 to the power of 4 infinity points, it's not going to be a struggle at all because I have I have more of the third infinity dimension. It looks like I'm just going to need to get up to about E104 money again. And, and yeah, it looks like this is what a lot of the game is for now. And yes, it can get repetitive, but it's just fun, especially, see... Um, Especially if I, I sort of want to see what happens when I just like um, when I just like leave it overnight and then and then just see what what happens like if I gain like a ridiculous amount of infinity points like you can see this is this is actually going up like linearly this must be some sort of polynomial um, I'm not sure exactly what the formula of the infinity points is but it may be something like that something polynomial oriented so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna get um 10 to the power of four infinity points again so here we go and buy an infinity dimension two so now now you can see how quick it is to get money i'm i jumped to e50 in seconds and even, even higher like, I'm also, it's just it's just fun to like leave it alone for like a few seconds and then just click max all and suddenly I have several more orders of magnitude. The only sort of annoying thing is you can't hold M, but that that's okay. So what I'm gonna be doing, I I want to see if there's more than eight dimensions because there's eight dimensions in the main game and it's like it's it's like a big theme with antimatter dimensions. There's only eight dimensions. It's basically that way from nearly the very beginning, and it never there's never more than eight dimensions. There's eight normal dimensions, eight infinity dimensions, there's eight time dimensions, eight meta dimensions, but no ninth dimension. So, so here is E128. So, is there a ninth dimension? Yes, there is a ninth dimension. I I really did not know if there was one or not, but it looks like there will there is. I'm not going to unlock it until, like, um, a lot later on, but there is, just, just knowing that there is a ninth dimension is just, 
it's just f fun to, um, fun to note. So look at this, I can actually, not only I can gain E5 infinity points, I can get E6 infinity points. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get two of these, and this is going to really, um, help progression speed. It's actually a faster game. I thought this is a relatively slower game, but this is actually really fast. Just, just like in Samaria Dimension, the game plus plus plus, if you see the first episode of that series. So... Yeah, uh, th this game is pretty exciting for me. I mean, it's, it's just fun to see the numbers just getting bigger and bigger. And I have heard this game actually um, has the second biggest numbers of any incremental game that currently exists. Because this, I've heard this game goes all the way um, past 10 to the power, um, t it goes past a Googleplex. The, the limit in this game is the um, hard cap um, based on its code, and that hard cap is um, 10 to the power of 10 to the power of 308. So that, that's, that's a huge number. The only game that goes further is a game called Incremental Unlimited. It's actually for mobile, surprisingly, which reaches 10 to the power of 10 to the power of 10 to the power of 25. So that's just, that's just exciting concept so I can I can boost infinity dimension 2 and it looks like um, I'm just gonna do like this and then like just like just like one more clip until I I leave until this episode wraps up and I wonder what what it takes to get eternity points like th that seems pretty cool um, I mean this game is simple but it's just it's fun because there is this is why it's called infinite layers. It look, looks like there's going to be infinite number of dimensions and there's going to be infinite prestige layers. So right now there's only one prestige layer, but I can't wait until there's like five, six. I wonder what's going to happen. Okay, I'm back about maybe 10 or so minutes later and and look at this. When I max all, look at that. Whoa. I'm suddenly up to E237 money. I wonder if there's any mechanic that involves E308. I'm not sure, but I'm just going to get these infinity points. And this is going to actually allow me to do a lot. First of all, I can get infinity dimension 4. I can buy one more tier of infinity dimension 3, infinity dimension 2, and then three tiers of infinity dimension 1. This should make my progression speed explode and how ridiculous this game has gotten look at this i'm up to e180 without even trying basically so th this game is has a lot of um potential for to, to do a pretty long series i'm not exactly sure how many i mean i think there is gonna be infinite layers of this but i'm i'm not exactly sure what's gonna hap happen eventually so um stay tuned for more episodes of this series so yeah hope you enjoyed peace out